Can you set the record straight on one thing, which is this issue about the layoffs? I think you said initially that Tesla, 10% of the workforce would be cut, then 10% of salary would be cut, then salary would stay flat and overall headcount would go up. What, what, what is the number? I know there's already, I think, been a, a lawsuit about the 10%. Is 10% is the goal to reduce the workforce? Or what is the number that we should think about or that you're planning? Yes. Uh, so Tesla is reducing the salaried workforce by roughly 10% um, over the next probably three months or so. Um, the, uh, we expect to grow our, our um, hourly workforce. Uh, it's quite clear that we expect to grow our, our, our hourly workforce, um, but we uh, we grew very fast with, on, the, on the salaried side, um, and we grew a little too fast in some areas, and so it requires a reduction in the salaried workforce. And we're about two thirds uh, hourly and one third salary. So I guess technically a 10% reduction in the salaried workforce is only roughly a three, three and a half percent reduction in total headcount. Um, okay, so, now, so I, think uh, that num I think that number is important legally, isn't it? Because I think people are trying to say, if, you, if you're going to lay off 10% of your workforce, you have, even in America, to make an announcement about that. We did make an announcement. <laughs> um, okay. y yes. Um, l let's not read too much into a, a preemptive law lawsuit that has no standing. Um, that, 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 that is a, a small lawsuit of minor consequence that just anything that related to Tesla gets big headlines, but it is whether it, it is, um, you know, a, a bicycle accident or something much more serious. Uh, it's still, it, it, it seems like anything related to Tesla gets a lot of clicks, whether, for, whether it is trivial or significant. Uh, I would put that uh, lawsuit you're referring to in the trivial category. Um, so uh, a year from now, I think our headcount will be higher in both uh, salaried and obviously in hourly. Um, but in the short term of the next few months, uh, we expect to see, like I said, roughly a 10 percent reduction in uh, salary work, salaried workforce, which is actually just really only a three, three and a half percent reduction in total headcount and uh, not uh, super material.